When I started this game, what? When I started this game, I was so innocent. I honestly believe. I had a little mantra, open your heart and the rest will come. Open your heart and the rest will come. I'd repeat it before auditions, at breaks in rehearsal, in the moment before stepping into character and from the dark wings onto the bright stage. <sighs> Open your heart and the rest will come. I sent the contract yesterday. Was it the James Dean audition? Or maybe all my sons burned this? Langford Wilson could write a scene. Anyway, I signed in and opened the door into the waiting room, a dance studio with three mirrored walls. And there must have been 40 me's, all in white t-shirts and jeans, all exactly like me, all sitting in fold-up chairs in a circle. Every single one of them exactly like me. Ah, open your heart and the rest will follow. I walked out the door, ran down the stairs and sat in a park and watched the ducks all day. I'll paint the walls my fucking self. Tell Scenics if we're not ready to go tomorrow morning, I'm not paying, and they could fuck off back to art school. Run the fans overnight to dry the paint. Another time, I aced this third callback. It's a famous writer. It was a great role. Would have changed my career. And the director calls me into, into his office, and he says, uh, and the, and the director calls me into his office, closes the door, looks at the couch. I love the guy's work. Made great films. His Richard III blew my mind. Really respected the guy. Top of his game, fit, intelligent. Open your heart, Andrew. Open your heart, open your heart and puts his hand on my cheek. You know how this goes, he says. What, I ask, you want the part? Yes, I say. Then you know what to do. He shoves his index finger into my mouth, hooks my soft palate like a fish, starts undoing his belt. So innocent. Get on your knees. He already has his cock out stroking, salivating. Open your heart and the rest will follow. Open your heart and the rest. I gave him the tiniest shove and with his pants around his thighs, he falls back into the couch, into the sofa. You're a cliche, I say. And you can't act, he says. You're a cliche, I say. And you can't act, he says, with a face like a spoiled brat who just dropped his ice cream. I slam the door on my way out. Funny thing is, the guy was fit. If I'd met him on the street or in the gym, at a club with no power dynamics, the whole thing, well. Yeah. Oh, Jesus, tell her to call the showrunner. I'm not getting between the writers and the talent. Below my pay grade. Just tell her to be on time. When I was at, when I was at the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art, RADA, the queen came to visit. Yep, Queen Elizabeth, the queen of fucking England, came to our workshop. She was so tiny. She was this little fairy godmother. A little, little elfin deity. <laughs> uh, she caught the tail end of my but I get a 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 I was running up and down the skit. I was but I get a 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 but I get a
takes took my hand and said, I must say, I must say, you certainly have the lungs, but you don't have the chops. I didn't know what to say. What do you do? Just open your heart and the rest will follow. Your Majesty, I hope I do. May I suggest you study law, make your fortune, then return to the stage. She dropped my hand and walked out of the room, all the guards following her. My classmates snickering at the stupid American, so innocent, I was so innocent. You know, I haven't thought of that moment since. No, no, no. Those numbers are off. They're wrong. I'm not transferring them another cent. Fuck the union. I don't care. Tell them if they don't show up tomorrow, they'll never work again. Good. Fine. Yeah. Yesterday on set, an extra came up to me and said, you know, we've been waiting for seven hours. Are you going to use us? Are you getting paid? I asked. Yes, she said. She kind of looked like my mother. Then shut up and go back to holding till we use you. Just open your heart and the rest will come. When I was younger, I promised to treat people well. All people. Better than people had been treating me. When I started this, uh, when I started this game, I was so young. 